2023 saw the Gladstone event sponsored by Duo Hardbaits, now distributed by Wilson, and it was a very close event at the top of the leaderboard. Last year's winner, Tom Deere, placed second to the on-fire Queensland angler, Chris Lonnie. Yellowfin dominated Pikeys this year, and here's how the field did it. Number one, finally. I don't believe I did it that. Okay, so that's number two. I hope he's not in the bag at the end of the day. Not that big, it's just in the current. Oh, be nice. Number three.
<laughs> oh, he fell off. That's <laughs> number five. <laughs> And Wally Fay's improvement keeps on happening. He ended up with another top 10 just out of the money, but it was a happy Wally. Brisbane's Blake O'Grady's competed at Gladstone for several years now and his milk run of spots yielded him a sixth place.
that'll that'll tickle you up the. Uh, I'll get rid of those little ones. <coughs> oh yes, just a little one. That's good times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good times. Good times. And another top 10 for Queensland's Jamie McEwen all but assured him the 2023 Daiwa Brim Series Angler of the Year title. Here's how he caught his fish. And we've got to take the time to check out Scott Skakluna's massive mangrove jack. No, 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 I'm putting the camera on Fifty, Jack. <laughs> Woo!
These pylons get a bit shallower on the other side up there. There's more barra on the base of this one. That's a pikey number two. Geez, they're solid built, these ones. No wonder they weigh heavier on the way curve. Well, these two until we change it all back to the elephant curve. It's on the Rapala Fat Jack, that one. It's pikey number two. That's a fish. He crushed it on the imposter. Decent one, though. It's the elephant. That's what I mean. You just winch him out. <laughs> He's probably bigger than everyone I caught yesterday. Let's just stop him there. Oh. I did see a few decent elephants. Probably bigger than this yesterday on the bridge, but they didn't eat. So a good sign. I might be biting this morning. Felt more like a brim bite, but it doesn't feel very big. Yeah, it's a pikey. And sadly, this is my limit fish. <laughs> well, happily or sadly, I don't know. I'll get another 100 grams anyway. <laughs> I'll take it. on the duo. Little jerk bait that I'm using like a crankbait. There's a fish. Oh, what is that long tom? Oh no, it was just I wasn't looking at the fish. Oh, that's a that's a yellowfin. Nah, I'll be right. I'll pull him in. I'll just wait till I get something right. He'll upgrade that little twenty centimeter one, though. Fat yellow fin. Now, Rockhampton's Mixed Slade is one of these barra guys who has aspirations to be the number one ranked brim angler in the country. Yep, that's true. Here's his form on the pikeys.
number four. And last but not least, here's some action from Little H, Harry Schofield's boat. Some brim and a lost remora. It's nuts, eh? Yeah. Dumb looking thing. And of course, if you want to catch up with all of the results and reports from the event, you can visit ABT's website, which is www.abt.org.au.